Today on Two Crazy Ketos, we're going to review Keto Farm Snack Mix. And we're going to have a giveaway right, right after, after this. this. What's up, family? I'm Rachel. And I'm Joe. And we are Two, Two Crazy, Crazy Ketos. Ketos. If you're new to our channel, welcome. Here on Two Crazy Ketos, we do different things like recipe videos. We do product reviews. We talk about various keto topics. And then every Monday, we sit down on the couch for Keto on the Couch. We just kind of talk about what's going on in our lives for the week. You can find us on different social media platforms like Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And we also have a website, which is TwoCrazyKetos.com. And that's where you're going to find all of our different recipes. Now, we do upload at least five new videos every single week. So make sure you subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to hit the little bell icon in that way every Every single time we upload a new video, you'll be alerted to it. Yeah. So today we're going to review uh, Keto Farms Keto Snack Mix. And we have um, sampled them before in our Keto Crates. In our Keto Crates. And we have three different flavors here. We have a strawberry Gouda. It's very Gouda. And uh, we have raspberry Gouda, mm -hmm. which I think we've tried both of these. Both of them. And then we also have, which we have not tried, this tomato pepper jack. A, kind of a savory. And this is a savory spicy one. I'm excited. And so I'm like super excited about this, but we were able to meet them at KetoCon. It's been a little while. I mean, this is the middle of August and we were at KetoCon the last weekend of June. But the summer flew by. Yeah, summer flew by and we had so many videos and we really wanted to give this its own video. Because it really is delicious. And if you have been mix, missing like a granola, like or a trail mix. A trail mix. It's or kind of a party mix yep. for like a party that this is kind of what this is. Yeah. Now, when we were at KetoCon, we did get to meet Benjamin, who is one of the owners. So Rachel had a chance to talk to him. So let's like roll that footage and let you guys see like about the company starting. Mm -hmm. Hey guys, so this is Benjamin from Keto Farms, and if you got a, we got in a review box a um, just a little sample of their. Um, it was the to, was it the tomato and gouda? No, it was the raspberry and gouda. Yep. And it was delicious. So I was super excited that they had more offerings. They have a tomato one. It's kind of like savory. Yep. And tomato pepper jack, spicy. And strawberry gouda, and this stuff is crazy good. If you mix, miss like. Snack mix, trail mix, that sort of thing. This crunchy, is crunchy, crunchy yes. snacks on keto. There's not, yeah. This is you're not gonna squish in and be like coconut oil. No, yeah, this yeah, is exactly. the, the delicious crunch that you've been missing. So, what what's got you started? How how old is this business? The company's only a year old. Um, Amazing. So we've been uh, doing a lot in a year, and this product itself is only about six months old since January of this year. Before that, we had a line of instant keto beverages, keto uh -huh. lattes. A coffee, a keto coffee, a keto matcha, which are really delicious and people really love. Yeah. But these are so simple. You just tear open a bag, you enjoy it. It has that crunch that we all miss from before keto. And it's really simple. It's clean food. So in this bag, you have uh, crunchy strawberry slices, you have Gouda cheese, and you have almonds, and you have uh, pecans, and that's it. A little MCT oil and sea salt for seasoning. Just really clean ingredients you can feel good about. Really clean. I love clean. the packaging. It's like simple but like elegant at the same time. It makes you think of like, I'm going on a hike. Yes. And I want to exactly. bring the trail mix. Yes. Exactly. Well, I'm going to go on a hike to my couch and I just want to eat an entire bag full of this stuff. It's so delicious. So in the future, we're going to be seeing more from these guys. All right? So Keto Farms, you have to check them out. Like, how can we're going to do a giveaway you? in the future, oh. right? Yeah, absolutely. Yes. How can we find you? We just launched on Amazon like three weeks ago, so we're really excited about that. So just search Keto Farms on Amazon. We'll leave a link down in the description. Exactly, you'll find us. We're running a coupon right now for $5 off. We'll be doing that all of July. Um, and then we can also do a special promo code for you guys as well, so people can really combine and save the most to try us. That is awesome, so check them out on Amazon. So Benjamin was like an awesome guy. Super nice guy. And I'm actually glad that we're doing this video now because as we head into football season, yep. you're looking for game day snacks. Yes. And I think that this is a perfect option for it because um, it's not too sweet, but it's got like a nice mix of flavors. Right. Like it's a great like, you know, bar food. Is that yeah. is that a like a bar I snack? Think perfect. Bar, bar food. That's exactly a, what a this is. snack. Now, now in that video, um, Benjamin did mention that he would hook us up with a special code because he talked about a coupon code in July. Well, July is gone. 
Uh, so I will message him and remind him that he said he would do something like that. Mm -hmm. If he does give me a coupon code, I will leave it here along the bottom of the screen. Okay. Uh, but you can get it directly on Amazon, but we'll talk about that when we get to the review part. Uh, but he did say when I was messaging him, we're going to do a giveaway for this at the end of the video, and we're going to give away this flavor here. The spicy. The one that we've never gotten before in a keto crate, the tomato pepper jack. Nice. So you want to, we'll, how about we taste this one, since we've already had these, yeah. we had them in keto crates. Mm -hmm. So the ingredients on this are Monterey Jack cheese with jalapeno peppers which consists of pasteurized milk and jalapeno peppers, cheese cultures, salt, and enzymes. Then it has sprouted organic walnuts. Nice. Sprouted traditional almond or transitional almonds, grape tomatoes, MCT oil, uh, cold water, sea salt, and dried jalapeno chilies. Very clean ingredients. Super clean ingredients. Yeah. And does say it contains dairy milk and tree nuts. And now for the servings, this bag is three and a half servings. Or one for Rachel. A third of a cup per serving, which is 29 grams. 170 calories, 13 grams of fat, four grams of saturated fat, seven grams of protein, five grams of carbohydrates, two grams of dietary fiber. So it is three net carbs per serving. So, but a nice, oh, more fat than protein. Yep. So if you were to eat this entire bag, you'd be looking at what, 12... 13 and a half carbs if you ate the entire bag. That's not terrible. At 13 and a half net carbs, it would be like 17 total carbs. But that's not a bad deal. Especially when you consider what the carbs are. Now, just to compare some of these other ones, I guess they're all the same. Yeah. Yeah, they're all the same exact nutrition. Nice. So, so just so you want to go over the ingredients on these real quick. So this one is Gouda cheese. Okay. Sprouted organic pecans. This one has walnuts. Sprouted transitional almonds. Same. Strawberries, MCT oil, cold water, sea salt. The only difference with this one, raspberries. Awesome. Okay, you ready? Yes. For a snack? Always. It's always a good time for a snack. I also like the fact that these bags... I actually like this packaging. It's like super Very slick. clean, simple. Yeah. It looks like an artisanal snack. Mmm. Okay, so let's do this. I have a scale here. Okay. Before we do anything, let's measure out a serving. Because they're saying it's a third of a cup, and we actually yeah. have a third of a cup. No, cup I measure. don't have. I have. I want to see if it fits in that third of a cup. That's a quarter of a cup over there. Oh, okay. Never but mind. I don't want to shortchange myself. That is a serving. That's a pretty decent yeah, serving. Yeah, that's a good serving. Now you can see in here. Let's see. We're gonna hold it up. So. There's different things in here. You have cheese, there's tomatoes, there's nuts. Definitely see like the little dried jalapenos. You can definitely see the pieces. Here's another kind of nut. What else is there? Walnuts. Oh, there's almonds. almonds. That's pretty. Those are the different ingredients in there. Yeah. So if you can see that, if it can focus cheese. there. So I'm going to give you that. Jalapenos. So you get something of everything. I like it. And I'm going to take... So we got an almond, a pecan, a walnut, a piece of cheese, and a strawberry. Not a strawberry. Another strawberry. A tomato. Ready? Yep. You're going to eat it all at once or one at a time? No. I guess you kind of get eat this all at once, don't I, you? I, you're supposed to, but I have to have mine, like, separated. Okay. Got to keep them separated. Well, I had the walnut, and it gives you, a, like, a little a kick. That's what I got, too. That's got a kick. I just realized now that we're tasting something spicy that I have no drink. I did not plan this well. Mmm. That dusting of jalapeno. It's good. Is legit. Okay. Tomato. No, that was good. It's, it's because it's dried, it's sweet. Mmm. It is sweet. It is. It's got, a, it's got a sweet with a kick at the end because of the jalapeno. Almost reminds me of like a sun-dried tomato. Jeez. Wow. Wow, that tomato is flavorful. Mm -hmm. But I mean spicy. It is legitimately spicy. Okay. Now let's do this. Mm. You got to get all the flavors at one time. Oh, man. All right. Wow, that is like... That cheese had some spice on it. It is like in my throat. Ready? Mm -hmm. Yes. Got to have them all together. Mm. You get this mixture of flavors when you have them all together. Wow. 
That is nice. Right? Yeah. That's you gotta delicious. Eat it. You want to eat them one by one. But. Either way, it's a win. Yeah. That is delicious. That is awesome. That is great. That is nice knowing, like, that. that's a great party mix. These will be going in my truck so I don't have to share them with you. Uh-huh. <laughs> No, I'm just kidding. Guess what? He is. What these will be good is on salad. We always say that. You always make fun of me by saying, like, anything that's sweet, I top it on top of an ice cream. Well, our salads are generally spring lettuce, right? So you want to add a little bit of crunch to it. Perfect. This is perfect. So perfect. Look at the tomato on my scale. It's okay. Really good. You want to put this through five things? Five things. Five things. So if you're new to our channel, we review all products based on five things. We talk about the ingredients, does it keto based on nutrition, how does it taste, how much does it cost, and finally, would we recommend it? Yep. So number one, the ingredients. You cannot get cleaner I ingredients. Maybe if you grew the, the, the trees yourself. Honestly, I will say this. So, I mean, this is a bold statement. We have tried a lot of keto products. You still have to say this is a processed product. It right? is. This is. It comes mm -hmm. in a package. Yep. It's not being pulled out of the ground. That's right. It's not just a piece of meat. Mm -hmm. This has to be the cleanest ingredients on any keto packaged product that I have personally tasted to date. Yeah, because you're not even, I don't even see anything that's like a preservative. No, yeah. there is no. It's literally, it's like dried cheese, dried it. jalapeno peppers, dried, you know, walnuts, which are sprouted, by the way. The, the nuts are sprouted. Dried tomatoes, MCT oil, and cold water, or sea salt. I mean. I mean, it's just good. This has got to have the cleanest ingredients. There is some, is there any copy on the back here? No, not really. Just like what it is. It's real food, better snacking. Tomatoes and spicy peppers, zesty pepper jack cheese, sprouted almonds and walnuts. I mean, it says we make clean, convenient foods for healthy keto living so you can live and feel your best wherever life takes you. And then it says snack clean with real nourishing food, satisfy cravings without sacrificing your health. It's super, super clean. Like, no kidding. Like, cleanest ingredients. ingredients I've had in a processed product yet. Yeah. Okay. So number two, does it keto based on nutrition? Definitely. Yeah. 170 calories, 13 grams of fat, 7 grams of protein, 5 total carbohydrates, 3 net carbs. So even if you're a total carb person, which most total carb people eat like 20 to 30 total carbs, you could literally eat the entire bag and still only be, like, still have plenty of carbs left for the day. Yeah, which is awesome. Right? I mean, 15 total carbs if you eat the entire bag, and or I mean, a little bit more. And it's, it's so and crunchy and delicious, but it's dried versus like fried. It's not like in some gross oil or anything like that. It's just great. Yep. So, so number three, how does it taste? They have nailed the flavor profile. Now we've had these other flavors before, so we're not trying them again today because I want to keep them nice and sealed. And we have some small ones in from our like keto crates and stuff. But I have to say, they're really good at sweet too. So you've got like a little tart. Tart and sweet tanginess from um, like the strawberries or raspberries. And then you have that nice cheese and the nuts. I mean, it's just really, they're very good at yeah. complementing one another. I really, because I do like the sweet ones, but I really like this because sometimes you want a savory. Like all the keto snacks out there are sweet, right? Right. Cookies, bars, things like that. And the most savory thing you ever get is like cheese snacks. And sometimes they're too salty. Things like, yeah. you know, wisps and stuff like that. Yeah. And this has just a really Perfect. nice flavor. Yep. So, yeah, taste is awesome. Number four, how much does it cost? Should I brace myself? It's not too bad, especially when you consider what's in it. So you buy them on Amazon. Okay. It's $25 for three bags. So about... So it's about $8, eight dollars a bag, right? Just about $8 a bag. They do have a subscribe and save coupon. And he does put them on sale every once in a while. I will leave a link down below, and you can buy it four different ways. You can buy... Three bags of the tomato pepper jack, which is for some reason labeled on Amazon as jalapeno. Because I was like, ooh, is there a fourth flavor? <laughs> no. But it's not. When you click on the jalapeno, it's the tomato pepper jack. Then it's got, you can get three bags of the strawberry gouda. Mm -hmm. You can get three bags of the raspberry gouda. Or you can get a combo where it's one of each bag. I would definitely recommend a combo. The combo. Get the combo. Yeah. You know? But I will leave a link for that down below. Mm -hmm. And again, we're not affiliates with them all. We just really, we just really it. enjoy it. And they were super nice guys. And again, I love the fact of their why. And I love the fact that it's just like two guys from within the community. Like, I'm going to come up with a good healthy snack. Well, and they're just, they're definitely packaging this stuff with integrity. Yep. Good stuff. So, number five, would we recommend it? Absolutely, we yeah. would. It is a bit pricey, $8 a bag. But again, you're paying 
for a good healthy snack. I mean, a lot of times we we are going and buying moon cheese and stuff like that and paying you know, three, four, five dollars for an individual serving bag. Right. And I mean, and that stuff is delicious, but this has got like a very like fancy pants mm -hmm. taste profile going on. Yeah. And as we go into um, the, like the fall and you have to bring something, you know, to add to like the, the potluck table and you want to bring a little snack, this is really nice. People will super duper appreciate this. Right. And again, like I'm starting to do with a lot of things, I'm starting to break it down per serving. So $8 a bag, there's three and a half servings. So really I'm looking at, th there's three servings. Right. You know, who's using a half a serving? Uh, no. You know, so what does that come out to be? Like just about what, 250 a serving, 275 a serving? We're like at a that's, bar. That you're at a bar price again. So yeah. it's not like super bad. No, it's not crazy. Well, that is our video for today. Let us know down in the comment section if you have ever tried Keto Farms and if you have what your favorite flavor is. Because we want to give some away. Yeah, oh, that's right. I forgot we're giving them away. So Brandon said that we can give away the tomato pepper jack. Mm -hmm. uh, so we're going to do the same thing we always do. We won't give away this bag Not that we've this tasted. Bag. He's, they're going to actually directly mail it to you. A fresh bag. All you have to do is subscribe to our channel. Mm -hmm. um, hit the like button on this video. Nice. And then uh, leave a comment down below. Yeah. Right. Oh, and you have to be live in the continental United States to enter. Sorry. So any comment will uh, end in the giveaway. We'll run it for one week. We'll put the date across the bottom right here for when we're going to end the giveaway. I'd be interested to know where would you be taking the snack mix? Are you taking it to the movies? Are you sharing it with a friend? Are you going to enjoy it while you watch football? The foosball? <laughs> if you've watched The Waterboy? But yeah. Where are you eating this stuff? Sounds good. So that is our video for today. If you like what you saw, do us a favor, hit the like button down below. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the little bell icon and that way every single time we upload a new video, you'll be alerted to it. Until next time. Bye. Bye. Bye.